So you're having issues getting VRR to work on your TCL R635? Well, I'm gonna show you how to get it enabled today. Hey guys, welcome back to Cringy Tech Talk. My name is Chris. If you're new here, then welcome. We're a channel that's dedicated to talking all things tech with a focus on gaming and streaming for both consoles and PCs. If you like the content, then please consider hitting that subscribe button and liking this video. It helps me out more than you know. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at how to get VRR enabled on your TCL R635 when using your Xbox Series X. We'll go through the settings on the TV and then the settings on the Xbox and then we'll be done. Should be a fairly quick video, but I hope you enjoy it and let's get into it. So the first thing you do is go to your homepage and go down to your settings. And then you're gonna go down to TV inputs. And this is where I have my Xbox connected and you're gonna see variable refresh rate as an option. You wanna go over to select that and make sure that it is on. And you should get a message that says VRR is on, happy gaming. It's super important that you turn on VIR on your TV settings before you try to turn it on on your Xbox because you may have issues if you don't. And for some reason, this setting wasn't turned on by default when I first got my TV, so make sure you turn it on. Another thing that I would suggest is you go ahead and do a full shutdown of your Xbox. So you want to do this by going to the settings and then you're going to go to general and then power mode and startup and then you'll see an option for full shutdown. Now, I recommend doing this because sometimes when you make changes outside of the Xbox, like on your TV or your receiver, uh, for some reason, the Xbox doesn't like accepting those changes unless it has a full shutdown, in my experience. So go ahead and just do a full shutdown and it'll make sure that it works. All right, so we've got VRR enabled on the TV, so let's go ahead and turn it on in the Xbox settings. So you're gonna wanna go to settings and then you're gonna go to TV display options. And then you're gonna go over to advanced video modes. And then on this option, on this screen, you'll see allow variable refresh rate. And you wanna go ahead and enable that. If you don't see that option, make sure you did a full shutdown, like I suggested, make sure that you have VRR and turned on in the menu of the TV, like I mentioned, and you should be able to see it if you have those. And then you can confirm that VRR is enabled by pressing the middle button on the controller while you have a game launched, and you'll see that it says VRR in the bottom of the section readings. And that's how you have VRR turned on on your TCL R635. If you're curious how to get 1440p 120 frames to work on this TV, then check out this video that I've posted that will show you how to properly set up your TV to run 1440p at 120 FPS. And that wraps up for our video. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you guys enjoyed the video, then please leave me a subscribe and a like. Uh, if you have any questions below, then go ahead and ask away. That's what we're here for to help you help you out. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful evening. Peace out.